Okay, two sum. Let's continue. Um, we're going to talk about uh, the change that happens when we accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior, and, uh, and and when we we get this beautiful gift of desire to know God better, and uh, the reason why we pray, the reason why we go to the Scriptures for guidance. Um, but most importantly, uh, I think that you um, you know it's all going to be about. You know your the uh, attitude of how you look at stuff, and so if you don't like the way your life is looking, um, change the way your life is by uh, changing the way you look at it, and uh, you can do that by accepting Jesus as your Lord and Savior, and then uh, beginning your walk home. So, uh, speaking of walking, have you ever watched a caterpillar walk on the ground? Um, Personally, I think they're cute, but I can see how people would think that they're not cute. Uh, you know, they're very careful. They they just kind of walk along. They got tons and tons of legs, and and all of a sudden there's a puddle, and and they have to decide. You know, the hey, I'm not going through that puddle. I'm gonna go around it, and uh, so they kind of work their way around it, and then all of a sudden there's a rock, and then you know I got a choice here as a caterpillar. I can you know it's just arduous. I'm gonna have to walk over that rock, or go around it. So they either do that, and they and they. And then they're constantly making these decisions. They're slow. They're um, susceptible to being eaten and uh, by birds and this and that. And um, and their life is just a struggle. And uh, one day they decide to go climb up a tree. And they go up this tree. And then they kind of cuddle underneath a, a, a nice, beautiful green leaf. And, uh, and, and they form themselves a cocoon. And... Uh, much like what we do when we decide to um, change as well, uh, and we're called by God to uh, believe in His Son, and then and, and and then we start a cocoon period where we're 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 changing and uh, we're transforming, we're becoming something different, and an evolution process that uh, was always meant to be for each human being, and uh, so this cocoon process where we you know we. Uh, our, 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 not only does our physicality change, but um, so does our uh, spirituality and the way that we believe and, and whatnot. And then someday, um, when the timing is just right, we, we re are released from this cocoon. And the old part of us has died and changed and we're no longer this long, wormy looking, leggy thing where we've actually um, formed wings and we've uh, we've we've changed into something beautiful, colorful and glorious. And it's all because of God's plan for us. Um, have you ever tried to catch a butterfly um, and then all of a sudden one lands on your shoulder that's what our lives are a lot like. Um, uh, it, it, it's a gift, uh, the gift of believing in Jesus and God, and and the, the gift of an eternal life is um, is a grace. And when we're given that, it's 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 a rich a riches that it has uncomprehensible um, uh, understanding of what that uh, gift is. So. A search process begins, and so we we begin our walk, our walk home, because none of us were really meant to ever um, to make this earth our home, but we have a home with God in heaven, and uh, we're, we we're, we start to learn that our Father is guiding us through His Word, and that's the Bible, and then we start to understand that um, our lives are entwined with others, intertwined. And, and how we react and how we respond to others is so important because it shows that we we are becoming more Christ-like and God-like. And that's, that's our goal in our life, to be more like our Father in heaven. And so one day we're released from this cocoon and, uh, and we're, we, our, whole, our whole being has changed. So that's, um, that's like a, a birth again. And uh, when this birth again happens... Um, 
were changed forever. So understand when you accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior, it's not going to stop you from sinning because our our sinful nature will continue. It's not going to make your life rosy here on earth because those struggles here on earth are the ones that give us more faith, that help us depend on God and and, and help us to understand our need for for the Father in every aspect of our lives. I'm sorry to say we're going to keep sinning. But um, those mistakes, we'll notice them quicker. We'll return back with um, asking for forgiveness and, and repent. Repentance will become part of our lives. And then we'll pray for guidance and strength and help from the Holy Spirit and from God and from Jesus. And that will make us different. And we'll learn to fly. We'll learn to soar. Just like the caterpillar changed 100% from that wormy guy down there on the earth, just struggling along to a to a uh, beautiful, um, enlightened creature that can flutter around, uh, flying over those rocks and puddles, and uh, it just um, just one hundred percent different than than what he was before. That's what makes him such a great example: the caterpillar and the butterfly, one and the same, but totally different. That's what a Christian is when they accept Jesus as their Lord and Savior. That's what a Christian is when they become more Christ-like. They become this beautiful, colorful, uh, joyful butterfly. And so I encourage you to become a butterfly this morning and uh, pray to our dad and just tell him that you love him and that you want to learn more about him. And, and he'll open up your minds and hearts so that you can learn how to fly and soar and change and and never look back uh, because a, a butterfly doesn't return to become a caterpillar again. No, he's 100% changed and uh, and you are too. And so good morning, Tucson. I hope you enjoyed that message, the message of the butterfly and the caterpillar. <laughs> good morning, everyone. May you and your families be blessed with God's love. And we pray all this in our Savior's name, Jesus our champion of champions. 